The goal is to get the transfer item, Peter's Oath, and this item is placed inside the blood red coffin in the center of the square. The area is full of roaming zombies, Kong Jin Hyuk said. If you want to get the oath inside the coffin, you must first break the barrier. You know this, right? Teresa's face is serious, I understand, but how to do it? Kong Jin Hyuk smiled mysteriously. It's simple, you just do what a tank should do, pull hate. The scene is all. Teresa jumps out of the stand, like a meteor falling. This invading human being pulled all the hate of the zombies around in an instant. Didi, Teresa has launched the battle song. Within 10 minutes, all attributes increase by 3 points. In the next second, all the zombies will rush towards Teresa. Killing undead creatures is always the duty of a paladin. Teresa raises her sword in front and activates LV5 strengthening the divine spirit. In this moment, she is like a goddess of war descended to the earth, radiating dazzling holy light. Zombies of a lower level began to melt directly. Teresa leads her army like a one-woman army, her holy sword cutting iron as if it were mod. Wherever she passes, there is a shining holy storm. The camera zooms out, and she is like a golden shield, holding back the tide of undead with her own power, trampling on skulls as she goes. Kang Jin Hyuk takes advantage of the opportunity to enter the battlefield. With a few quick movements, he consecutively moves through the heads of the undead. But suddenly, he realized something was wrong. Wait! This red lightning! No! With a thunderous sound, the crown explodes. The monster that emitted this thunderous roar was the boss-level monster, Elite Lich, who wears a gem-studded crown and wields a staff. The fire was raging but a barrier appeared in front of Kong Jin Hyuk. He was unharmed. You finally come out, elite lich. But in front of a high-level relic like this, how could a mage be without a warrior? The headless knight charges forward, and Kong quickly leans back, barely dodging the horizontal strike. In his mind, there shouldn't be a headless knight here. But no matter, it wouldn't defeat him. He jumps onto the headless knight, and the clumsy brute is split in half by the elite lich's lightning. Teammate injured. This method of killing with a borrowed knife is truly beautiful. Elite lich Lich, as a mindless lich, only knows how to constantly gather magic power. And the next moment, a burst of lightning wrapped in destruction flies out, aimed at Kong Jin Hyuk. Seeing that there's no way to avoid it, Kong Jin Hyuk suddenly stops in place, and in the split second before the lightning strikes, he wildly turns his head, and the red lightning strikes towards the barrier behind the coffin. With a crisp sound, the barrier breaks. The originally impenetrable defense was easily broken by Kong Jin Hyuk. The King of Bones was shot. The barrier was broken by himself. But Kong Jin Hyuk's speed did not slow down. He went through two headless knights, his hands forming a short knife. When he reached behind them, they were cut into countless pieces. This is the strength of a master. Oh yeah, oh yeah. It looks like the holy woman is finishing up too. So now, it's only you left, little skeleton. The elite lich was sweating. This underhanded human had used his own spell to break the barrier, preparing to fight to the death. But a blade flashed behind him, and the elite lich was split in two. One boot stepped on the half head left, crunching the bones as they broke. A tall man with a black sword stepped into the battlefield, his eyes fierce, sword raised, staring at Kong Jin Hyuk. Oh, it's been a long time. And facing him, Kong Jin Hyuk also rarely showed a serious expression. Activating True ILV2, directly acquired the opponent's attribute panel. DD. Chun Yu Song, level 29. Check details. Talent ability. Song of the Swords. One on one battlefield selection. Copy condition has appeared. With his most confident sword technique, he can copy the skill by stabbing him. Khan carefully thought about it. This black fish intestine sword is the same holy relic that went missing from the museum before. It was taken by this guy. He finally remembered that before the game became reality. There was a swordsman who was always hunting him in the game. Since he was defeated by him once, he was constantly bothering him, challenging him again and again and losing again and again. The two figures in his mind gradually overlapped. Oh, so it's you, the stalker. Chun Yusung gritted his teeth. You dared to underestimate me like this. But it's not the same this time. Kong Jin Hyuk, the game has restarted, and I am stronger than before. I won't lose to you. But Kang Jin Hyuk pointed to his back and said, If you want to fight me, ask my partner, the holy woman, if she agrees. Now it's two against one. Chan Yu Sung snorted, I won't let anyone interfere in our duel. He raised his sword and activated a skill. DD, battlefield selection activated. With the sword inserted into the ground, a barrier also enveloped the two of them in an instant. Kang Jin Hyuk could only take out a black spirit pill from the coffin before the barrier fully formed. Teresa shouted from a distance, Jin Hyuk. Kang Jin Hyuk smiled 
confidently. Don't worry, I'll see you soon. Holy woman, and the camera pans to the inside of the barrier where a sealed battlefield lies. Nobody can leave until the outcome of the fight is decided. Chun Yu Sun immediately activates his skill one on one, which increases all of his own attributes by 10% while decreasing all of Khan Jin Hyuk's attributes by 10%. So, you are the trundle? But facing the approaching enemy, Khan Jin Hyuk is not flustered. Oh yeah, oh yeah. It looks like the situation is becoming unfavorable for me. System has detected that your situation is extremely unfavorable. The condition for copying skills will be adjusted accordingly. Exchange has been adjusted so that skills are copied first and then the conditions for copying are met. Very good. This is the effect I want. Kang Jin Hyuk hooks his finger and says, All right, let's do this. Chun Yu Sung's talent ability, Sword Song, has been copied. The effect increases proficiency with sword type weapons by 200%. At this moment, Chun Yu Sung has already killed to the front, but Kang Jin Hyuk confidently summoned a plus 10 short knife and fought a white blade battle with Chun Yu Sung, a sword master. Chun Yu Sung was more and more frightened, thinking it's impossible for Kang Jin Hyuk, who is good at long range combat, to fight with sword with me. He looks at Kang Jin Hyuk's calm face and thought, Oh, my god, sword saint, is your sword technique just so mediocre? Enraged, Chun Yu Sung infused magic into his long sword and used his skill, soul chasing sword energy. In that instant, he split into two and released two sword waves that could rip the earth apart. However, Kang Jin Hyuk, who has mastered the sword song, calmly passed through the sword waves in the center. Now, he is at most equal to Chun Yu Sung in sword technique. If he wants to crush him, he still needs this. Kang Jin Hyuk used his S rank skill, sword song, with an S rank item, Soul Pill, to obtain a double S rank skill, Grave of Swords. He put the Soul Pill on his short sword and said to the system, I want to fuse Sword Song and Soul Pill skills and items. This kind of combination was unprecedented, but Kang Jin Hyuk's talent and skill fusion level was too high. The fusion was successful. The next second, the sword tip released demonic energy in sword aura, and the system announced that he had obtained an SS rank skill, Grave of Swords. It increased his understanding of sword and weapon by 500%. This ability was specially noted as one of the necessary abilities for obtaining the title of Sword Demon. At this moment, Kang Jin Hyuk was completely different from before. When he unleashed this skill, it was as if death had arrived. However, this high-level skill also came at a cost. At least, his right hand that held the sword was now on the brink of collapse due to insufficient magic power. But for Chun Yu Song, the feeling was completely different. The demonic energy was overwhelming. What kind of level of magic power was this? How could this man possess such a powerful sword intent? In the midst of his own fixed boundary, using his most skilled swordsmanship, why can he not defeat him, no matter in the game or in reality? Young man, it's not your fault. It's just that Kang Jin Hyuk is a cheater. Chun Yu Sung roars to the sky. His worldview collapses. He rushes towards Kang Jin Hyuk in a frenzy, striking with his sword repeatedly. But Kang Jin Hyuk, who is facing sword strokes that would tear his skin, stands still without moving an inch. A clang is heard. That is the sound of the sword stroke being cut apart. The sword demon Kang Jin Hyuk has come. In an instant, he flashes behind Chun Yu Sung and says, Oh yeah, oh yeah, you're about to lose. He raises his short sword and chops down. Chun Yu Sung clings to his sword with both hands and barely resists the overwhelming killing intent, but in the end he is no match for the Grave of Swords' 500% high bonus. The short blade strikes the sword guard, completely knocking the sword out of his hand. It looks like, this time, you lost again. Chun Yu Sung half knelt on the ground, 138 times. This is the 138th time you've beaten me. Go ahead and finish me off. But Kang Jin Hyuk just chuckled. Next time we'll fight will be the 139th time, okay? Don't make that face. The Tower of Trials is dangerous, and it's better to have more skilled players. Besides, killing you doesn't benefit me at all. He reached out his hand, but Chun Yu Sung was stunned. Just now, he called me a skilled player? Being recognized by a stronger player was a lifelong pursuit, but Kang Jin Hyuk's mind was filled with dirty thoughts. The true reason being that the copy skills can only be used once every two months by a player. With so many good skills on Chun Yu Sung's body, of course, he wants to take advantage of them. Along with that, they also shook hands and the commune skill was activated, causing my favorability towards him to increase. Chun Yu Sung, with a haughty look, turned his head and said, I admit I lost this time, but next time, I will definitely defeat you. He then dissolved the inherent boundary and left.
The holy woman Teresa infused light into the object in her hand, which was the SS rank itemized tear, a tool which can replenish magic power for others. Due to his previous excessive use of the skill Sword Cemetery, he had lost too much magic power, and now these magic power supplements were important for him. As expected of a holy woman, she's truly a jack of all trades. But at this moment, a message popped up in front of Teresa. The master of the corrupted passage has invited you to save the members of Phoenix Guild. You have to go to the boss room. 